For anyone who is a fan of hazelnuts or other hazelnut products, word of a worldwide shortage can be troubling news. Thankfully, researchers at Rutgers have bred a new hazelnut tree that can thrive here in New Jersey and throughout the Northeast. Hello Rutgers, we're here on Hort Farm 3 with Dr. Tom Molnar, an associate professor in the plant biology department as part of the School of Environmental and Biological Sciences to talk about his groundbreaking research. So is there a hazelnut shortage? I, I think the, the saying hazelnut shortage is a little bit overblown at this point. It's really that there's a, a really steady increasing demand for hazelnuts and that's predicted to be quite large over the next five to ten years because of products like Nutella and Ferrero Rocher candies and other hazelnut products. And there really just simply is not enough hazelnuts planted around the world to meet that predicted demand. What makes New Jersey such a good place to start growing hazelnuts? Here in New Jersey we have a really good climate for example for growing peaches and apples and vegetables. Uh, it's, it's slightly moderated, we're close to the ocean, we have good soils, we have good water availability, so it really has to do with a, a combination of things, the climate, and then also in terms of these huge local markets that we have with New York City, Philadelphia, Boston, Washington DC, so we, we have a lot of the pieces to, to create a new industry here. So when do you think hazelnuts are going to start being grown on a large scale in New Jersey? So, so right now we're basically waiting on um, the ramping up of plant materials to get to farmers. And what we believe it'll be about the fall of 2020 when we'll have enough plants that farmers can basically, if they're interested in planting hazelnuts, that they can order plants and they can start planting them in the ground. So about two years before they'll be available. So how exactly does the breeding process work? We have our resistant hazelnut plant. Maybe it's not cold hardy enough or maybe the nut quality is not good enough. We would take pollen from that plant and we would cross it to, for example, a really excellent Italian hazelnut variety with with great nut quality and flavor. We make a, a traditional hand pollination and, and generate seeds, grow out thousands of seeds, and from there pick the plant that has the best combination of traits. And that's where our new varieties come from. Thanks, Dr. Molnar. As a hazelnut lover myself, it's good to know that the future of one of my favorite nuts is in good hands. So that's all you need to know about Dr. Molnar's research in a nutshell. I'm Ashley Cornish, RUTV.